You know, I wake up every day and I feel like I am extremely blessed to work in an organization that can offer so much to the community. I've seen people come into the Y with walkers or with a wheelchair. And months later, you see them actually walking out without any assistance whatsoever. And that's when you know that those programs are truly changing people's lives. The YMCA makes me uh, happy. Uh, makes me feel comfortable when I swim. Austin is just a fantastic soul. He started out at the YMCA in Special Olympics and then um, navigated through the ARC Foundation. And these are all organizations that the Y partners with to ensure that they have access to the health and wellness programs that we offer. Austin was diagnosed with autism when he was age five. The YMCA is like a family. I feel like a home. I feel very, very grateful to the people at the YMCA who are so welcoming and generous. I feel like it's not a job. It's kind of an honor to be able to go out and say, yeah, we can help you in that way, or let's partner in this way, or it, it excites me to know that we can help people. All of these programs are based off of needs in the community, and the why is serving those needs through the, the resources that we have. The Live Strong program is a really good example. Thinking about the why, is, it's, it's a very, um... It's emotional, it's a, it's a hard thing, you know, that, that it's, it's helped me feel good about myself in a way that I was not. It's getting them now to be ready to embark on the journey by themselves and still within their, their safe network and their family at the Y, but now on their own because we've given them hopefully the tools for them to carry on. As I've gotten physically stronger, I feel more uh, confident in myself to hear the stories and to receive the letters and the phone calls of people thanking you for the programs that you offer, it tells you that you're doing the right thing in the community. The Y has become vital to our family uh, over the last number of years, uh, particularly because of the investment they've made into our family. It's not a place where you just show up and you get to work out. You actually get to connect with individuals. Uh, and for us, connecting with staff, connecting with volunteers are very important for us as we kind of got established here in the community. The why has changed me in a lot of ways. They've just taught me so many life lessons and kind of walked alongside me when I was going through a lot of stuff in my life, and they really helped me. I am so grateful to also have these volunteers that come out once a year to help us fundraise, and that's well over 80 volunteers that come together in one month to raise $185,000. When I started volunteering more of a swim team and campaign, my parents kind of saw what I was doing and was encouraged to do the same. I started picking up on the heartbeat of what was going on and why these people are here and why this matters and I was like, wait a minute, I think this matters to me too and I care about this too, I want to be a part of what's going on. The funds being raised there are to support those who can't afford to be there, who can't afford some of those programs. I like raising the money for this particular cause because I've really grown up there and gotten the privilege to be part of all their programs. This year's campaign message is because of you. Um, and it's really wanting people to truly understand that it's because of you that individuals can actually experience what you've been experiencing. When I serve, I like to see how people's hearts and lives are transformed. This campaign has done a lot for our family and for our girls. They can't wait to get their stack of cards from the YMCA so we start calling people right away and raising money and seeing what comes in. and. I think it's grown them a lot because it's hard to get on the phone and having people say no to you on the phone, that's hard too. It's such a great feeling to know that you got to help that person and affect their life in a positive way. If you've been impacted, if you've had uh, an opportunity to walk through the doors of the Y, it's because somebody else actually gave probably for you to be there. And now you have the opportunity to do the same, to help other people walk through that door and have their lives impacted and changed. If we didn't have that money, all of these programs that we talk about would go away and our scholarships would go away. I feel like I couldn't stop going to the YMCA now because every time we walk in those doors, it's like we see everybody we know and it's like home. And um, I would never want to stop going there. I love it there. I love the fact that we partner with other nonprofits to do what we both do best, to fill a need in the community. This is what we're able to do when you support the Y.
This is my ticket to YMCA.